Hey guys, uh, welcome to my channel Data Driven Decision. In this channel, I talk about the data science and machine learning kind of stuff. If you're down for that, please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of awesome videos I make for the data science. So today's talk is all about the Z function in Julia and Python. So I'm going to showcase the Z function in Julia. At the same time, I'm going to show that in Python so that you'll have an understanding of both. They are pretty similar to each other. So let's get started. So what is a Z function? So if I go, if I tell you, the Z function is nothing but a zip together. Like you can see that there are two tuples I have given over here. A, this is a name, Sam, Charles, Mike. This is the one one. And B is basically, is going to be Veronica, Christy or Monica. So basically these are the name of the couples. So if I want to zip together the couples or marry those couples, then how can I do that? I can just use the zip function. Zip, first bracket A and B, and save it in X. So if you want to see the items in X, after you apply the zip function, you can use the for loop and use the print line in uh, Julia and showcase that. Okay, so if I just uh, run this cell, okay uh, yeah so you will see the output basically so you can see that like sam veronica charles christy mike monica so in that way you are able to see those outputs as a zip together in julia language and the same thing you can also do in python so in python you can see that the similar kind of structure in python also so i have given the names the same way use a zip function in the same way but the for loop is little different in terms of the formatting okay so if i just run this cell also you can see that like sam veronica charles christy mike monica so in this way the zip function works so it could be helpful for any many kind of scenarios in your data science journey and python journey altogether or julia journey Thank you for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of videos I make. Thank you.